Apple may have only just unveiled the iPhone 17 lineup, but the momentum around the next generation has already reached a point where early leaks, insider whispers, supply chain hints, and industry analysis are painting a picture of the iPhone 18 that feels far more dramatic, ambitious, and future-focused than anything Apple has attempted in recent years, creating a wave of excitement across tech communities. YouTube channels, forums, and even casual consumers who simply want to know how Apple plans to evolve the smartphone category in an era where competition from Samsung, Google, Huawei, OnePlus, and emerging AI-centered hardware brands has never been more intense. While the iPhone 17 brought its own design refresh with the aluminum unibody frame, the bold horizontal camera bar, and the improved graphics performance powered by Apple Silicon, the iPhone 18 is expected to take the entire experience several levels further by focusing on four core categories that consistently shape user decisions and long-term satisfaction. Design, performance, modem connectivity, and camera technology. According to multiple supply chain analysts and early leak trackers, Apple is preparing a shift in its traditional release schedule, with rumors suggesting that the iPhone 18 Pro and iPhone 18 Pro Max along with a long-anticipated foldable model, unofficially referred to as the iPhone Fold, may be introduced at Apple's September 2026 fall event, while the base models, including the standard iPhone 18 and iPhone 18 Plus, could be pushed to March 2027, marking the first staggered launch. Strategy Apple has used for iPhones since the pandemic-induced delay of the iPhone 12 in 2020. This potential delay isn't necessarily bad news for consumers. Instead, analysts believe it could give Apple more time to polish new display technologies, refine the in-house modem, expand Apple Intelligence AI features, and optimize the battery life on the new 2 nanometers A20 Pro chip, making the final product significantly better and more stable at launch. Meanwhile, design leaks reveal that Apple although interested in full-screen iPhones with no notches or dynamic island cutouts, is unlikely to reach true under-display Face ID hardware until the iPhone 19 or later, meaning the iPhone 18 Pro models will reportedly keep a smaller, slimmer version of the dynamic island, closer to a punch-hole-style silhouette, offering a futuristic aesthetic without the usability problems that fully hidden sensors sometimes cause during early generations. There is also talk of Apple experimenting with more transparent rear glass finishes, subtle color tints, and advanced coatings that enhance the phone's premium feel while improving grip and durability, making the iPhone 18 potentially one of the most visually distinctive models Apple has ever produced. On the connectivity front, Apple's long journey to move away from Qualcomm modems appears to be entering its next major phase. After years of setbacks, the introduction of the C1 modem in the iPhone 16 series and the improved C1X modem used in the iPhone Air model have shown that Apple's internal modem technology is finally catching up. For the iPhone 18, leaks suggest the debut of the C2 modem, offering faster 5G performance, improved network stability, lower power consumption, and better AI-assisted signal optimization, which could extend battery life significantly during video streaming gaming, and high bandwidth transfers. However, because Apple's licensing agreement with Qualcomm reportedly extends through 2027, not every version of the iPhone 18 lineup may feature the in-house modem, meaning some global variants, especially those sold in markets with complex 5G band requirements, might still rely on Qualcomm hardware for one more cycle. Moving on to the camera system, Apple appears to be taking a more refined, strategic approach rather than reinventing the entire setup. One notable change includes a redesigned camera control button, which could lose its capacitive touch layers in favor of a more reliable, pressure-sensitive system that still supports gesture shortcuts and precise half-press focusing. Even more exciting is the rumor that the regular iPhone 18 and iPhone 18 Plus models may finally receive a massive camera upgrade a 48-megapixel ultra-wide sensor, likely sourced from advanced Samsung ISIS-L or Sony IMX series hardware, giving base model users significantly better low-light photography, clearer night mode S, HOTS, richer landscape images, and smoother video capture. If true, 
This would be the first time Apple closes the gap this much between Pro and non-Pro models in terms of raw camera capability. But the biggest leap of all, the one generating the most hype across tech communities, is the performance jump expected from the new 2 nanometer A20 Pro chip designed by Apple and manufactured by TSMC using next-generation lithography processes that allow for dramatically higher transistor density, improved thermal efficiency, and artificial intelligence optimization baked directly into the silicon. This chip is rumored to deliver game-changing improvements in real-time rendering, ray tracing graphics, machine learning acceleration, multitasking fluidity, background process management, and overall responsiveness, enabling smoother gameplay, faster photo and video editing, more accurate voice processing, and longer battery endurance even under heavy workloads. Combined with Apple Intelligence, Apple's new AI system integrated deeply in iOS. The iPhone 18 could become one of the most intelligent and responsive smartphones ever created. Additionally, battery life improvements are expected not only from the A20 Pro chip efficiency gains, but also from potential increases in battery density, new thermal management designs, and AI-driven charging optimization that learns usage patterns and adjusts charging cycles to preserve long-term battery health. All of this, when combined, makes the iPhone 18 lineup feel like a milestone moment in Apple's long-term strategy. A moment where design evolution, AI integration, connectivity independence, camera refinement, and performance breakthroughs collide into a single generation that has the potential to redefine how people use their smartphones, how creators film and edit content, how gamers play high-performance titles on mobile hardware, and how Apple positions itself in the increasingly competitive landscape of next-gen premium smartphones. With so many early leaks, rumors, and insider expectations suggesting that Apple is preparing something bold and forward-thinking, the iPhone 18 is becoming one of the most anticipated tech launches of the decade, sparking discussions about whether users should skip the iPhone 17 entirely and wait for this next wave of innovation. Whether you're excited about the refreshed design, the next-generation modem, the 2 nanometers chip, the advanced camera upgrades, or the potential shift in Apple's release timeline. One thing is clear. The iPhone 18 is shaping up to be far more than just another yearly refresh. It is positioning itself as a true generational leap that could set new standards for performance, photography, AI integration. And Apple's larger ecosystem evolution in 2026 and 2027.